And teams hit the field in Savoy today. Athletes went to Culvert Park for the first Champagne Beat Ball Tournament. WCIA's three, Jamie Mays has more. This game is what these players have been looking forward to. Just enjoy the vibe of other players around you and just just be competitive out there. To be able to do this and just be completely free and open is liberating. It's baseball. Oh. But with a bit of a twist, this tournament is for those who are blind, low vision, and illegally blind. For some, this is more than a game. It's a second chance to pursue a dream. Prior to going blind, I was a sighted baseball player. And I had uh, dreams and aspirations of being a left-handed starting pitcher for the Cubs. This sport is providing an opportunity. It has allowed me to get back into the competitive nature of sports. And it's given me the ability to look at this as my Major League Baseball. It's similar to baseball, but with some differences. Each ball has a beeping sound. So when it heads towards a player in the field, defense can hear it coming. Yeah. Everyone that plays the game has to wear a blindfold to make the playing field equal. The only uh, people that are not blindfolded are the pitchers, the catchers, and the spotters in the field. You don't have to worry about, well, I can't see where I'm going. Because on this field, they're not alone. It shows that there's teamwork, uh, social skills, team building. Just something that you can't put into words how much it means to you. In Savoy, Jamie Mays, WCIA3, your local news leader.